Hello, and thank you so very much for joining me tonight. I go by Loon and Nate, and in this session, we're going to be pulling, plucking, extracting, releasing, transmuting our insecurities, things that are very rooted in us, things that almost become our story or our character. I'm going to be very general here, but feeling like you are unlucky, feeling like you are born under the wrong star sign, feeling like things never go your way, or the bubble always bursts right before you get to whatever that kind of level or success that you're looking for, or feeling called to create or experience insecurities about your appearance, about your finances, about your relationships, about your skills, communication, your neural processes. Kind of an insecurity that you're awkward or that people don't understand you. Anything at all that keeps you limited to a rigid character, to a rigid avatar, and prevents your evolution or your flexibility with yourself and how you experience yourself, and therefore how you let the rest of us experience you, we could say. I just have a quick sponsored portion for us. Thank you so much for allowing me to pay my bills. I really appreciate it, and I'll see you very soon. Thank you so very much to Scentbird for sponsoring our video today. I'm pretty sure you've heard of Scentbird before, but just in case you haven't, they are an awesome, amazing, wonderful fragrance subscription service where you get to choose a new designer fragrance to try out every month and just for $17. Choosing a new fragrance, especially online, is kind of an overwhelming and risky feeling sort of experience, but Scentbird has a wonderful quiz that you can take where they'll ask you some questions and you will be presented with a collection of scents chosen just for you as a way to introduce you to some possible scents that you'll enjoy. Of course, you can skip any month without penalties and you can also upgrade to receive two or three products a month if you prefer. With every fragrance, you'll get 30 days worth, so a 30-day supply, which you can use to try out fragrances before committing to a full bottle. There are over 600 designer brands to choose from, with top designers like Prada, Gucci, Versace, and also indie niche brands like Skylar, Heretic, and Confessions of a Rebel. The vials are super generous, eight times bigger than regular perfume samples, and I love how easy they are to put in your purse or pocket, to stash in your car, so that you always have your signature scent of the day with you. Personally, I really love, especially this time of year, it's September when I'm creating this, so I love like fiery, woodsy, smoky smells. I love vanilla, bourbon smells, that cognac smell. And I love taking inspiration either from my outfit on what scent I want to wear or what scent do I want to wear today? What am I feeling? And how can I kind of craft my outfit around that? <laughs> Scentbird also recently upgraded their packaging. So they have this like new and improved look. The selection that I was given this month includes Burberry Brit Sheer, which has notes of peony, yuzu, peach blossom, musk, and pineapple. I really do like this one. It's very clean and fresh and fruity smelling. And speaking of fruity, I also received the DKNY Be Delicious. Ah, oh, these are so classic, right? Green apple, grapefruit, cucumber, tuberose, and white woods. Oof, this one's really yummy. I love that apple smell. Of course, another classic here from Dulce and Gabbana, the light blue which has notes of lemon, apple, cedar, bamboo, musk, which is truly just such a wearable smell. We have Versace, bright crystal absolute, which has peony, raspberry, yuzu, pomegranate, and musk. Very nice, very flirty, flirty smell. And my personal favorite of the selection I was given is from Confessions of a Rebel, Bitch Please. <laughs> It has black currant, jasmine, sandalwood, and skin musk. And the sandalwood just adds such a richness to this. I absolutely love this smell. It's so good. Make sure to click the link below in my video description here and use my code Loon Innate 
for 55% off your first month at Semper. That's only about $8 for your first month. And also exciting news for my neighbors to the north, Semper is now available in Canada. Thank you so very much to Scentbird for sponsoring our video today. And thank you so, so, so much. Viewers, subscribers truly could not do this without you. I appreciate you so much. And now let's get into our session. So I have some candles burning back here already that I've set with intention. So we're gonna go right in and focus on connecting, channeling through and claiming, of course, Love, benevolence, kindness, support, honoring your free will, your personal boundaries, of course. We're gonna channel through and through like a wave coming in, receiving, stirring, coming in. And we're going to call to the surface consciousness, sub and waking, and before we begin to plug, we're going to just do a little trimming, a little accessing of the root to just make this process that much more easy. So our intention is to connect with that which I just declared, and of course not limited to my words, any insecurity, any disempowered quality, you know, that you really see as being in yourself, and I don't mean this in any way to disempower the things that we have to deal with, you know, like I have dyslexia. Can I work around it? Can I, you know, like overcome it? Perhaps, perhaps there are ways that I could work with this more to be more empowered, but it's still a challenge that I face, so you know, I don't mean to discredit or um, disvalidate, invalidate our experiences. So I hope you know what I'm trying to say here. But we're gonna access, call, and just trim at the very root. Whether they are from early childhood, adolescence, in utero, past life, whatever it might be, we're just getting it right at the root so we can extract yourself that time to be flexible with yourself. It's almost like chords, we could say, because I'm sure there's an emotional connection here. An emotional dynamic, or part of this dynamic emotionally affects us.
we release, when we ex exhale all of this, when we declare we are no longer attached in a sense to these things, we are no longer accepting in a taking it for granted sort of context. creating an opportunity to redesign, we could say, rework our avatar. Maybe you feel like you're an impatient person and you kind of paint yourself that way. Can you take on patience? Can you release that, taking it for granted? Patience to bring in patience, and we will call all of, all of these beautiful qualities in in another session. So this is the releasing session. Now, exhale. Good. A flow. A pure energy. Take a breath in. Feel how much more space is in the qualities of you if you are a pie chart. <laughs> and exhale. into the back of the mind and out, released, directed, let go of. You don't have to think about it unless you want to just allow your subconscious to do the work here. Allow your subconscious to be guided, to release the attachment to any disempowering quality or insecurity. And if it's something being dyslexic or being asthmatic, obviously just speaking for myself here, that I have to deal with. I have to take my medicine every day, you know? <laughs> Whatever it is, those things, let's transmute the perspective on them. Know that there is a little flexibility in some way or another. So we're going to transmute, transmute, to empower see ourselves regardless of that which we can't change or that we continually have to deal with in our lives. Disabilities, um, societal systems and how we feel our place in them. Things that are everyday situations. But 
please remember there is so much you can change so much so much so much and it all begins within you so channeling through in the palms You don't have to see them if you don't want to. You can face them if you feel called. You can just let it happen. Like waves moving, turning. And we're gonna like we're scraping the foam of the ocean.
Sophie. 